How's it going ladies and gentlemen, my name is Monero and welcome back to Minecraft. So, as you can see I did a bit of work on our ender blind. I got rid of the stairs and I replaced everything with cobblestone and made a ladder instead of stairs since it takes up less room. I also built the bridge that I was talking about in the last part across. Sheep! Sheep! What are you doing in the tree, sheep? You're not a... You're not a bird. You're not a bird. Why is this sheep in a tree? Get get out of there. So yeah, I built the bridge across. As you can see, it looks a bit weird now. But I built the second platform I was talking about. And I basically replaced everything with cobblestone. Just so the Enderman can't pick any of the blocks up. And we'll go up here. So this is the new platform. I forgot to put ledges on. So we'll, we'll do that quickly. So this is the, the latest addition is the platform up here so we can look up here we can look out and be like hey enderman why don't you come on up and have a party with us or something like that and also while i was building at night time rolled around so what i did was i stayed another night and tested it out again you know waited to see for if more endermen would rock up and things like that and i got incredibly lucky i think i actually had a group of three spawn right over there and then i had another one spawn there once i had killed them and another one spawned down there like the first one and but uh, i got three ender pearls so i think this is a pretty successful venture so far we seem to be uh getting exactly what we need which is ender pearls, and we got them pretty quickly. So what I, I, as you can see, yeah, filled it all out with cobblestone and things like that. Got three ender pearls, so I'm pretty happy. Now I mentioned in the last part that I wanted to get started and get working on a mob spawner, so I've laid down kind of the base for the mob spawner to give me an idea of uh, how big it's going to be and positioning. I cleared an area for it. We probably don't need cobblestone. I'm going to try and build it out of wood. We do have two stacks. More than two stacks of wood, so we have enough. I'll pro I don't know if I'll need the ladders for now. Mm, not sure. We'll leave the ladders for now in case we... Uh, I don't think we'll need them. We might come back if we do. But I have gone ahead and laid down the base of where it's going to be. I might build some sort of tunnel or something to get over here easier. Or clear these trees out and make a path. It's alright, buddy. Hey! What? what? I was going to let you live. I was going to let you live. And look what you've gone and done. You've, you've gone and felt my wrath, bloody tiger thingies, whatever he was. So here it is here. It's Simba. It's the circle of life. Anyway, so I've laid down the base here as you can see. And this is the idea behind it is um, they will fall down this tube. And the reason I built this out of glass, and I forgot to grab glass, so we may as well run back and get it. The reason I built that out of glass is because uh, we're going to put lava in, of course. So lava can go on top of glass and can't go on top of wood. And it'll kind of, it might look pretty too. That damn sheep is still up in that, that tree. I don't know what he's doing up there. So I did cook up glass. I think it's in here, yeah. We had a stack of sand, so I cooked up a lot of glass for us. So I think... Uh, wood and glass is all we really need to get this thing built. Um, I hope it works, but with mob spawners, there's lots of variables and there's lots of things that can stop it working. Um, you know, we could have a cavern right underneath us that we don't know about, and that's why it can be quite difficult. I was thinking about building it really high into the sky, but I think for now we might build it more just a couple blocks high, and we'll see how we go to start with, and then if we run into any issues, we can always... Um, change the height of it, we can knock it down and maybe dig it into the ground or we can put it up higher in the sky depending on whether it works or not. So I've got to figure out how I'm going to accomplish this. I guess since there's water there I should be able to jump into it hopefully without dying. So I guess we just go up. Now this is one two blocks. I just have to place them all around. Now, I'm not sure how high I'm going to make it. I may, might make it like ten blocks high or something. We'll see. Uh, actually Ah, oh, damn it. Lost glass already. We'll have to leave those ones there for now. And I'm an idiot because we did need them to go up for a reason. Ah, sometimes, so sometimes, sometimes I do things and I just, I just don't know why. I don't know why I do them. Uh, so, uh, I'll probably just get to building this up and I'll cut back once I've got it up. I think I might make it maybe 
10 high or not quite. I'm not sure. We'll see how much glass we've got before I make a final decision on how high I'm going to make it. And I'll see you guys once I've built it up and we start building the platform around it. So, okay, I decided just to build it up 10. I was going to build it high, so it's like this anticlimactic cut back to you because it's, it's really not that high. Um, but we do have a bit of leftover glass, which we will need. We're going to need to make some more wood. Might as well combine those two. And we'll start here, I guess. Now, we'll have to be very careful not to fall off, because if I don't land in the water, I probably will die if I fall. Now, I'm trying to think how wide I want to make this. I'm thinking maybe 16 by 16 would be a good idea. So, if that's one, two, if that, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then we'll go this side, and then 10, 11, but wait, I said 11, I said 11, 12, 13, 14, and how many's out this way? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 out that side, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, is that right? I think that should be right, that's 1, I think that's right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, whew, I almost didn't make that, so if that's 7 out, so it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then 2 here makes it 9, and then 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 7 either side, my math is brilliant today, <laughs> so that's 7 either side, so that makes it easy doing these ones though, because then we just know that it's 2, uh, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Okay, we'll get going on this side as well. Do not fall, do not fall. And we'll build this out. So this time I might cut back to you where it's <laughs> more of uh, stuff is actually built and it's not just like, ah, oh, yeah, we went a few feet higher. I'll get the platform built, then come back. <laughs> All, right. All right, so it's uh, built the platform up. We are 10 high off the glass down there, as you can see, 10 high. And we built the platform up and I'm trying to get it leveled out and it decided to snow on me while I was building. There's lots of snow in here now. We get rid of it with a shovel, I guess. Kind of annoying. I'm in the middle of uh, sitting here building it. You know, it already feels dangerous and unsafe. It starts raining, starts snowing on me. Damn, crazy wild weather. So we have got it built up now. And we just need to kind of get it going, which means we're going to need buckets of water. We'll have to go get some buckets, of course. Get out of here, Snow. I'm over you. Uh, I, I liked you once, but no more. No more, Snow. We can't be friends. Okay. So, I hope we have enough wood. We are running a bit low here on the old wood department. But hopefully, it's okay. Now, essentially... You want it to go like this. Oh, that's right. Well, I accidentally put those on. Didn't mean to do that. Come with me, blocks, if you want to live. And we'll build this one out here. So these are going to be the platforms that they will stand on. Ooh, almost went down. Probably shouldn't run backwards like that when there's a, a big hole there. Okay. There we go. Get this one done. Yeah, we're, I'm hoping we have enough wood. We should. We should have enough wood if we turn that into a stack. Yeah. I, 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 don't, don't, don't go anywhere. Don't you go anywhere. That should be plenty, I think. Should be plenty. And we'll start filling these out. Now, since we don't need to accommodate it for Enderman, since our platform seems to be working, we'll just make it too high so that it's basically for skeleton archers, creepers... Um, that's we, that one's there. And what are the other guys that we're talking about here? Creepers, skeleton archers, I'm trying to think. Uh, I guess spiders go in there as well because we can get string for our bow and arrow. Now this has got to be eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that will be eight. That'll where the water source blocks will go. And these can come out here. And that should be that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. So I'll quickly just do it to the others as well, and then we'll get water. Okay, so those are built up now. 
shit, I really didn't think about uh, getting down, did I? So, before I go jumping down, since I don't really, I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to get my way back up here, we will um, quickly build this up. I think we are going to run out of wood, though, unfortunately. I don't know. We'll get whatever. Oh, we still got a stack. Still got a stack. That goes across there. Alrighty. That one goes across there. It's getting there. It's getting there. It took a while. It took a little while to get done. Uh, I'll jump up and get these all placed in. Gotta jump up, 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 cause I'm telling you. I've had that song stuck in my head for days now. Uh, so, ah, oh shit. No, no, that's right. I made another stack. I was like, how did that stack go so quickly? It's because it did not. It did not go quickly at all. All right, so that's going to be our roof level there. So I'll just pull it out. So that way, the creepy crawlies can only spawn too high. They'll get pushed in. I might put torches up really quickly. Um to keep it illuminated while we work on it so nothing spawns and kills me while I'm up here doing my work. And we'll try and get the roof built as much as we possibly can. We are definitely going to need more wood though, unfortunately. Uh, jump up there. Okay, Tr roof, whatever your name is, roof, roof, roof. Uh, I'll put the roof on this baby, and I'll probably see you guys when we go to collect water and uh, give it a test run, I think. Okay, so the roof is on. The roof is on, and I've got the, we just got to get water and bring our lava in. I built this out. I think that's the right amount. I think it's three across. Well, I hope to hell it is, and we do have a little bit of wood left. We'll probably need that to uh, get ourselves back up on the roof and put the water in. So let's go get our buckets of lava, and we'll need a few buckets of water as well. I hope we have enough buckets. If not, I mean, I guess we got lots of iron ore, so we can always make more. Hey, where are your buckets? You should be in gardening supplies. So how many are we going to need? One, two, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think we're going to need eight buckets. We'll grab those. You know what? We'll dump the lava first. And that way we can use those two buckets, so we'll do that now. We need two signs. I know that we need two signs, I don't want to screw that up, because that tricks the lava into thinking there is a block, which stops it actually flowing. Oh no, it's snowing again! Not again! Damn you, snow. Damn you. Raining and snowing. Beautiful combination. So, um, just trying to remember how to do this. Okay, we're going to have to... Break some glass, unfortunately. I'm sorry, glass. And we're going to get those signs out. Oh, I'm still holding those ender pills. I should probably put them away somewhere. And the signs have to go like that. And like that. Now that should, hopefully, work. I'm hoping. Fingers, fingers crossed this works. Otherwise, we're going to have maybe a semi-disaster on our hands. Uh, okay, please work. Please work. It should just go off the edge one block. Yes, it works. So the monsters come down, as you can see, and they basically just get burnt by the lava. And they burn, sucker, burn. Oh shit, I fell in the water. I fell in the water. That's not good. That is not good. Oh, there's stair- I completely forgot that I put this block at the end. Go away, Snow. You're ruining my beautiful creation. Okay, let's go get some water. And that- how did that pig get in my pen? How? Piggy? Why'd you do it, Piggy? Alright, well, we're gonna... Oh, I forgot to put all these snowballs away, too. Actually, we can just do that, can't we? Forgot that you can stack it and grab them. So now we got to try and make our damn way back up on top, though, which should be, uh, will be an interesting challenge. Now, I'm trying to imagine how to get up there. There's trees over here, so I don't really think this part through. Uh, maybe if we get up on a tree, can we make that? Nope. If we get up on a tree, we can get up this way. Uh, maybe. We just need to kind of get over there. Uh, we should probably keep that one. We'll need it. Uh, that should go there. Uh, there we go. Easy. Who, who was worried? 
not not this guy. <laughs> okay, uh, we will need to put some torches up since it is snowing right now to protect those source blocks, so I might do that. And it, uh, I guess it also illuminates this area so that none of the creepy crawlies will spawn on it. Oh shit, I completely forgot to torch up the roof, so I'm going to have to try and get my way over there eventually and torch that up. So now we got torches. Let's let's test this one out. Let's, what the fudge? Water, come to me. I don't know what the hell. Oh, I think it might have been because there was the uh, half block thingy in there of snow, or the snow affected it somehow. So that should roll right to the edge. If we go in, should be pushing us off the edge, but not flowing over. Yes, my calculations were all correct for once. It's it's a rare, it's rare when this happens when I actually get things right the first time. Okay, so that should do the same. Yep, okay, awesome. Going well, going well. Got so many buckets. Pile them up together. Okay. Put our last few in. Our finishing touches. Flood me away. <laughs> now, like I said, though, I don't know if this will work. We could build, could have spent all this time building it. And honestly, not have it work at all for us. Uh, which is, pff, probably will happen knowing my luck. Now, we're going to have to block this area up here off. Um, just trying to remember how, to, how I want to do this. Oh, actually. This is going to be tricky. Oh no, it won't. We can always just dig a path in here and come back out. You block that off. You don't. You basically just want to block off any light source at all. Do we have any more wood? No. Okay, this is going to be tricky. So I'm going to have to block off all the light sources. But as you guys can see, you can see how it works. Now, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to have time to see if we can get it working in complete motion. This was the one we came up on, wasn't it? So we want to save this one till last. We're going to have to get some more wood because I believe I am completely out of wood now. Uh, like these are the, the only blocks I seem to have. But um, it looks like it should work. Re hey! A scorpion! Hey Mr. Scorpion! Over here! Ha! Yeah, you want to, you want to go? You do not stab me. Hey! What what the hell? <laughs> okay, why is there like a baby scorpion? What is going on here? You die. Hey, that, that was weird. I've never really killed those scorpions before. I don't know. Do they do that every time? I have no idea. So yeah, at least it's built as far as like we can see that it's built. And or we will have a look at it, I guess, at the start of the next part. And I'll get it finished in between parts and finish the roof off and everything like that. But as you can see, they get flooded down, they fall down, hit the lava, burn in the lava. I'm hoping that is the right height, because they they're a block down. It should be the right height so that the items don't fling up on top there and burn away. Items wash away, and then we collect them down here. So I might actually end this part here, guys. I think we put in a good bit of work on the building. Um, as for what's coming up next, as far as this series goes, the most of you guys seem to be leaning towards wanting to do the Millionaire mod quest line. So I think we're going to be starting that in either the next part or the part after. Most likely the next part, I'm going to try and do a bulk of the building on this in between parts, so we can go straight into the Millionaire mod. Um, if you like the video, don't forget to smack the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're not already to see more content. And I'll catch you for whatever I make next. Bye.